Trying to avoid potholes in mid-Michigan right now can make it feel like you're on an obstacle course and relief is still a ways away. County road departments are just now starting to get money from the state's new road funding plan. So with limited money, using it efficiently is crucial. Fox 47's Christopher Lane talked to the people in charge of spending it to find out how long the process could take. Drivers across Michigan are frustrated with the state of the roads. I think they're terrible. Beth Ann Jenks navigates potholes too much and she wants there to be a fix. I feel like there should be some sort of money to go to fix them. Bill Conklin of the Ingham County Road Commission tells me that because of a lack of funding, close to half of Ingham County's roads are in bad shape like these ones. But with increased funding from 2017 to 2021, counties across the state will be able to put in significant work. Well, I would think most county road agencies would pretty much look at this as a lifeline that was tossed. This is the first year that lifeline will go to road commissions, as each of the 83 across Michigan will get a roughly 25% bump in funding. But it won't be until next year when it increases by another 25% that roads will get serious work. That'll be a 50% increase for us for 2018. That's when we really start to be able to get caught up on our maintenance, uh, start to get more of our roads in good condition. Conklin says right now only a quarter of the roads are in good condition and need no work, but it's the 50% that are in poor condition that bother drivers. When your like, whole small car can get gobbled up in one pothole, that's pretty bad. But with major work still more than a year away, drivers will have to keep dodging potholes until then. In Ingham County, Christopher Lane, Fox 47 News. Road Commission representatives will talk to legislators tomorrow about what's going on with the roads in their home districts and what needs to be done to fix them.